Welcome back my families. Today I'm going to make black garlic braid. So what I'm using is dark rice seeded braid, but it's up to you. You can use any other braid that you like. I've got here, I already mixed a bit of butter in it, but you don't have to because I was trying to do something and then, yeah, that was a mistake. So anyway, I have one cup of black garlic, which I've already peeled. Normally I make a lot and store it. And I'm using about 150 gram of salted butter, one cup of parsley, about two cups of grated cheese, that's optional. And I'm also going to use balsamic vinegar. Again, that's an optional. Okay, now let's feed it through this chute in here. My sincere apologies to all the um, subscribers that I haven't released one video last week. It's because I was so busy sewing. Feed in all the butter. And it's really up to you. So if you like more butter, you can add more butter. If you want less butter, you can reduce the butter. And I'm going to blend this now. Okay. That's blended. Hope you can see that. That's how it looks like. Okay, because when you blend very for a bit long, and you can see the butter is just melted. But that's okay. That's all good. And I'm going to put in some parsley. Again, I said it's up to you. If you don't like parsley, don't add it in. I love parsley. And just give it a good mix. I'm going to drop, pour in half a teaspoon. Sorry, sorry. One teaspoon of uh, balsamic vinegar and then taste it. If you don't like balsamic vinegar, don't add it in. I'm just going to get a spoon to try. It's really good. Okay, there's two way of doing it. Make sure preheat the oven to 180 degrees Celsius for at least 10 minutes. I'm using fan four, so I will reduce it to 140. And um, you can toast the bread first, and then you can put the spread on top and you have it as it is. Or you can spread it onto the bread and you can uh, bake it as well. So it's really up to you how you like it. I'm going to make it both ways because I like it as it is. So I'm going to add a little bit more. Maybe I'll add the whole lot. That's two teaspoons. Okay. You can buy uh, pre-made black garlic from Costco. They sell it. If you'd like to know how to make it, just... Uh, Leave it in your in my in our comment section, and I'll get back to you. I learned how to make like black garlic bread. Uh, sorry, black garlic from Andrew. So shout out to Andrew. I know about the black garlic, but I never made it. So he showed me once, and then yeah, and I said I'm not going to buy it anymore, and I make it. Since then, I make it. Thanks, Andrew, if you're watching. Okay, now that's done. So take a generous amount and just spread it like that. For this one, I'm just going to toast it in the oven and then add the garlic paste as we are eating okay so that's one version and the other version i'm going to add cheese on top of it if you don't have a food processor don't worry about it you can use blender okay i'll put it aside that's how it should look so i'm going to put cheese on this one maybe that's a bigger braid you can mix the cheese into the paste but i don't want to mix it because i'm going to have it different way to eat it okay i'm going to put this in the oven for five to ten minutes till the cheese is melted. I've just removed from the oven. It's too hot, I'll show you. I've got to wear a mitten. So that's how it looks. The cheese is slightly melted. Slightly melted, I'm not going to let it all melt it because otherwise it will burn the bread. Just move it here so you can have a look. So this is plain. I'm just going to spread it on the plain one and have it as it is. I'm cutting into bite sizes. With the plain one that I toasted, cool it down before you spread the butter, garlic mixture. And see how it is. And I'm going to spread some garlic. It's a little bit here in the broken pieces and tell you exactly how it tastes. It is so good. You all have to make this and try it and you will love it. Mm. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like it, please give a like and support this video. I'll bring you more videos. Thank you for watching. 